How the heck did you leave? Did you even tell them you're leaving? No, the backyard. What the heck? Rainick, Rainick, Dada, baby. Do me, gang. I just left the hotel that I am in. And I just want to start off this vlog by giving a warning to all the haters who are trying to threaten me, trying to act tough towards me. All I'm saying is, if I ever see you guys in person, I promise you, you will get knocked the f out. It ain't Twitter, it's not social media. If you disrespect me in my face in person, I will slap the f out of you. Seriously, I was forced to leave Montreal because of a hater. I mean, I could have stayed and changed hotels. But I just didn't want to deal with it. But right now, I'm heated. If I ever see one of y'all little punks trying to disrespect me in my face, I promise you, I'm telling you, you will get f up. Anyways, guys, I hope you all are having an amazing day. If you guys aren't, I really hope this vlog brightens up your day. Today's actually going to be a special day because I am going to see Hayla. I just texted her and told her to meet me in Starbucks because I am around my crib. So I'm going to go to her, see how she's doing, and talk to her and let her update you guys with everything and have her update everything to me also because I do not know what's going on. So I'm heading to Starbucks right now. Hayla should be there. So I'll see you guys in the next chat. Guys, I see Hayla right now. Hayla, what's up? I missed you so much. How you doing? Doing good? Good. How's everything? Good? Good. Chilling? Where were you? What? Why are you running away? We're in the duty thing. Yeah, but I know, but I'm saying like... No, I was your vlog. You were just watching me? Yeah, I know, but I'm just saying... That's, I didn't know what to do. That's kind of stalkery. <laughs> I didn't know what to do. <laughs> Guys, I'm here with Hayla. So, Seriously, yo. I'm about to get in trouble after this upload. <laughs> I'm gonna get in big trouble. What are you saying? I'm gonna get in big trouble. It's alright, it's alright. All right. I have so many questions, Hayla. Seriously. What are they saying at home? Like, what's going on? They're just trying to brainwash and talk and trying to convince me, but... What, what they've been telling you? What they've been telling you? That it's bad to be in vlogs and that you're not supposed to be in it. You're older, but I don't care. Now let me fix my screen. Oh, my God. What else are they saying? Oh, uh, that you're a bad influence on me. Damn. Mom is saying I'm a bad influence? <laughs> and I said... What the heck? Like, me telling me. you? Me telling you to, like... <laughs> To be yourself and to, to, to achieve your dream and like, like what do you want to be when you're older? Like, like what do you want to do? I want to, I want to do business and marketing. Ah, so you want to do business marketing? Like, yeah. What, what do you want to do though? Have my own company. So you want to have your own company? That's what, that's it. That's all I'm saying. And I want you to, I want you to achieve that. You know what I'm saying? I want you to, I want you to do that. You know? What else they been telling you? They keep showing me this fat guy. He's a part of my family or something. I don't just keep what, Why are they showing me. you? They, they keep, keep trying to hook us up or something. They're trying to get you married? What? Yeah. Oh my god, yo! I'm done. But that, they didn't even only ask me. They asked me and my other cousin. Like, what? How are you gonna ask us both? Like, what? What the? They asked <laughs> Yo, see, this is what my aunt does. So She's showing not just Hayley, but a lot of my other nieces the same person. Do you want him? No, do you want him? <laughs> what about you? Do you want him? Like, come on, man. It's, it's gotta be a joke, man. What's up? Man? <laughs> yo, seriously, it feels so good to reunite with Hayley. I'm sorry for like. Kind of stuck away and for me? I'm sorry for leaving you long. I'm sorry, Walla. I'm so sorry, but I'm still on the run right now. How'd you even come here? Walking. You walked here? Yes. With your heels on? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, yo, I don't know if I should blur your face out or not. Should no. I blur it? No. You sure? No, you don't have to blur it. <laughs> Guys, this has been one crazy journey. When is she leaving? Do you know when she's leaving or not? No, but she needs to leave. Yeah, and, and what about her like her kids? They're all there? Yep. How many of them? Like three. Oh, what are they doing in my crib? Uh, playing in your basement. Bro, like they're <laughs> with their PS4, they're playing with the gym equipment. Are you sick? Bro, they're in my freaking. Yo, I just. They scared I you bought away. that house. You know what I'm saying? I bought that house and they're freaking in my crib using my PS4, my stuff. Like, what the heck? I'm kicked out of my own house, Hayla. No, you're not. You're kicking yourself out right now. No, I, I am, Hayla. I can't stay there. I'm not gonna stay there. If, I, if I'm there, I can't. First of all, I can't even film if I'm there. Hey, you know? You can sneak in. I'm not gonna sneak in at all. I did sneak in yesterday, as you guys seen in the video. Yeah, we saw the video. Yeah, but like, I did, because I didn't know all her kids and her whole generation is coming, you know? But how you been though? How you feeling, for real? Good. You sure? Better than ever. All right, that's good, that's good. <laughs> all right, guys, Hyla wants to give a little message it's to good. everyone who's watching. So I'm, uh, what's your message, go? You don't have to be a boy or girl to do something. You can be both. Wait, yeah. That's came off. Yeah. Let's go jump in the video, like, yo, yo, yo. Hi. How you doing? Hi. What's up? How are you? Hi. How are you doing? Hi. Hi. What up? You doing? Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hey. All right. Um, it doesn't matter if you're a boy or girl. Oh my God, it's Wendy. You sorry, be, sorry. What's your message? You should be able to do the same thing, even if you're a boy or a girl. Have the same opportunities. It shouldn't be different. You should be equal. I like that. Yeah, someone's like trying to tell you different. Then time to go. 
What's up? How you doing? No good. What up? Yo, what's up? We out here. What's your name? Shia. Y'all looking fly with that tracksuit. I like it. Thank you. All right, guys. I'm a low key drop off Hayla because it's raining right now and I do not want her to walk in the rain. How the heck did you leave? Did you even tell them you're leaving? No, the backyard. What the heck? They won't realize. You're gonna get in trouble. Hayla, you're pretty much. You pretty much ran away for like. 20 minutes, 20, 30 minutes. You're gonna get in big trouble, bro. I'm gonna get in big trouble. Your yeah. 24 hours is up already. What do you mean my 24 hours is up? Your dad? What is my dad saying? You what's gonna happen? You don't wanna I really don't know what's gonna happen after 24 when hours. When you see him, when you see him, just send an invitation for your funeral. Yeah, I really don't know what the heck my dad is gonna do because 24 hours is up. It's like 48 hours now. Like, what is he gonna do? You don't wanna know. I don't know if he's joking or not, but the things he was saying, I feel bad for him. What was he saying? A lot. Like what? what was he saying? Yo, he's scaring me now. Ah, you're tight. Well, anyways, it feels good right now to vlog with Hyla. I guess she's finally back. I don't know if she's finally back or not. I don't know. But thumbs up for Hyla and for everything that she's going through. Cersei, you're being really, really strong. And I'm inspired by you, so knuckle touch. <laughs> Yeah, right there. Your dab is on there. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna drop her off and I'm probably gonna head to Slim's crib. I just watched his video. He's low key mad at me because I haven't been replying to him. I'm just really scared to go home. Like, what? Well, like, Adam, if you're really that scared to go home, you're gonna be flying out to all these different countries and shit. Why not just come to my crib, bro? You know, my crib is open. I got an extra room. So I'm gonna just surprise him right now and pull up to his crib and be like, yeah, I'm here to stay in your crib. <laughs> and Hyla? You don't know where Slim lives, right? Who? All of us? Yeah, but you're not gonna say nothing, right? No. And I'm only staying one night, so no one will know. Okay. Because when I'm there one night, the next day they'll know, but I'm gone, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Out, boom. <laughs> Why do you know how to run away? I have no, it's my first time doing this, you know? It is a dumb decision that I made. I, I wouldn't ever do it again, but like right now it's just, I got myself in a situation that I can't, I feel like I can't really take myself out the situation, you know? Hopefully soon I will, but for now, I'm going to Slim Screen. Hyla, good luck. I wish you the best with everything. I'm one phone call away, you know what I'm saying? So hit me up if anything, all right? All right, guys, so I just texted Slim telling him that I'm five minutes away. First of all, I want to publicly apologize to Slim. Sorry for not responding and sorry for not hitting you up and ghosting on you, but I'm pulling up to your crib right now to surprise you. So hopefully he's here and the door is open. Brother, thank you so much, man. Right, I appreciate you. This is low key awkward because yeah, I was kind of ghost and slim. But first of all, I'm gonna say I'm sorry. I didn't mean to like, I didn't mean to ghost you or nothing, but it was literally so much. Like, you don't understand how many times I'm always on the phone. You know, speaking to Hayla, speaking to my brother. I mean, even some parts where I'm speaking to my brother, I didn't even put it in a vlog or nothing like that, but he's talking to me. But I knew from the start I should have been came to Slim's crib because I did waste so much money on hotels. Checking my head, bro. I know, I know. You even call me, you even ignore me. I know, my I'm, text. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm Eric, sorry. I feel, honestly, I feel like. I feel, like a I feel like a side chick, bro. Honestly. What the heck? I'm serious. Like, what the so, fuck? Seriously. Come on, man. Like, you usually text me every day. Like, I know. So, you're my main chick, brother. For real. <laughs> you're my main chick. <laughs> nah, but for real, I'm, I'm sorry for the jokes. And, and I appreciate what you're doing. I'm staying in Slim's crib tonight, guys. As you guys know, I've been on the run. I've been in Montreal for like two days. I was in a hotel somewhere. I'm not going to say where. Shit. I can't believe that shit, bro. And now, I'm, I'm in Slim's crib. Going. I don't went on a whole fing adventure, bro. I can't bro, believe that shit. It's, <laughs> it, it's been a journey, well. It's been a wow. journey. It's been a crazy, crazy journey. I wish she was with me, but like, it ha everything happened so random. Like, it was so random. You don't know understand. My aunt came and I just did it. Damn. So random. We got a lot to catch up to, so I'll see you guys yeah. in the next time. We won't talk. All right, guys, so I'm here getting some work done. Let me know if you guys have gotten your tickets for the charity tour that I'm doing with Amir Khan. I'm so, so excited. I had to film a video for it. I'm sending them a video. This is a little preview. Yemen is entering its fourth year of humanitarian crisis. I'm really, really excited and I cannot wait to see you guys to help me support Yemen. I don't know if I'm gonna be on the run until I go to the UK because my aunt, she leaves on Sunday. So I'm most likely gonna go back Sunday or Monday, but I'm still low key scared. There's something in me that's saying, don't go back yet and to go back in Ramadan because in Ramadan, I don't think my dad will beat my butt. It's Ramadan, like if he hits me, you know, he breaks his fast, you know what I'm saying? Guys, we're also here with Fadi, you know what I'm saying? Making beats, Arab Mafia. Let me hear a beat, let me hear a beat. Play a little beat. He's always making beats, man. Fadi's so quiet, but he's always working, grinding, make I'm telling you, he does a lot behind the scenes, a lot. Let me hear Okay. Exclusive, never before. Okay, right? okay, let me hear I won't get cockroach either, so yes, yes. I need that. We got the thing right there, you know what I'm saying? The studio. Yeah, it's falling apart. <laughs> Yo, it's on Sigma. Uh. I already know it's gonna drop soon. Can you freestyle it? Let me see. Hold on. It's gonna be, okay. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Uh. 
Yo, yo, shout out to my auntie. <laughs> yo, should I sing it or should I rap it? You tell me. I, I don't know what I'm about to hear right, right, right now. Uh, uh. My auntie got married in the ninth grade. Hey, 2019 ain't shit changed. Hey, yo, hold on, yo, hold on. Yo, yo. I, I don't know what I'm saying. Bro. Yo, you do a diss track. I'm my aunt? Hi, bro. That was, what, you have more or not? Nah? I don't know, I was just, I was, yeah, more I was, mess, I was messing around. Bro, don't tap me because I will mess around and do a little diss track on. stuck in my head now, they're mad catchy. <laughs> Yo, guys, let me know if you guys want me to do a fun, this is for Bants, by the way, a diss track, like a real legit diss track on my aunt. Yo, I, I would violate, man, like, you know what I'm saying? Would you do it, bro? I would do it, I would do it for fun, I don't care what I'll do. <laughs> Matter of fact, I'm gonna release some stress. I have time in my hands. I'm not really doing anything. I'm on the run right now, so you know what? Fadi, drop the beat. I'm gonna record. Yo, what, why is it so like high up, man? Has Slim been recording some stuff? Yo, Slim has been making some stuff? I don't know, nah, it was me. It was me. Don't lie, bro. I know it's Slim, bro. Has Slim? Wait, I keep it the top secret, bro? Alright, okay. Fadi, drop the beat, man. <laughs> I'm gonna speak off the top of the dome for fun, bro, alright? Uh. Hey auntie, if you watching this, how you doing? Uh, uh. Yo, maybe it's good being on the run, man. The homie Slim is cooking up. Can I, can I go see what y'all making? We're making some hot dogs for you, bro. Yo, yeah. <laughs> I appreciate it, man. Walla, yo, I should have been. That's making food. Yo, man. I might just be here longer, man. Yeah, man. We got Chef Sophia up in here. Chef <laughs> Sophia. <laughs> Chef Sophia. Yo, thank you, Sophia. I appreciate it, bro. Thank you, guys. So, but still, thank you. Like, yeah. that's like, you know what I'm saying? You save me money. And you're giving me, like, you know, food to eat. You know what I'm saying? Yo, yeah, I guess. Yeah, you can't, you can't ever say no to hot dogs, man. Bro, I mean, man. Come on, seriously. Like, Nate. That's yo, that's like life on the being run. Being on the run. Yeah, but I'm telling you, bro, oh, you're welcome here anytime, bro. I feel My, like with life on the run, people just feel bad for you, people care for you more. Like, really? So I guess I'm gonna just <laughs> run away more. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna run away, I'm gonna run away next. <laughs> I'm gonna run away secret. <laughs> run away, please. Huh? Can you run away, please? Oh, oh damn. damn. You're supposed to munch it. Hey. <laughs> Hey, get your ass back in the kitchen. <laughs> yo, man. Yo, so you guys gonna bring the food? Tell me or shout out, like. Oh uh, yeah, man. Don't worry, we got Chef Sophia up in this bitch. Uh, okay, okay. Right, so you got this, bro. I bring it VIP service like that? Yeah, man. VIP. You <laughs> got it, bro. That's crazy, <laughs> man. Yo, so, and guess what we yeah, got? I feel like taking my shoes. So you can take my shoes or not? Uh huh. Oh, and we're not going that far. <laughs> <laughs> take that shit yourself, man. Guys, while I'm messing around recording, I got hot dogs, man. He shout out a slim man. I should have been ran away here, but the thing is, I know my dad knows where Slim lives. So I don't know, I might be here maybe for one day because the next day when the vlog is shown, my dad will probably see it. And let's wow. get it. Hey, right there, look at this, bro. This is better than papaya, bro. Better than bro. restaurant. Yo. All right, Adumi gang. So as you guys know, my comments are disabled because YouTube said that they want to protect the minors in my video, so they disabled my comments. I don't know how that protects minors. It just makes it worse for me because I can't get to talk to you guys. So I want to always do a segment where I read your DMs on Instagram since I can't read comments. Like seriously, I want to know the feedback. I want to know what to do on this whole thing that's going on. Like I want to know your opinions, your perspectives because you guys do help me a lot. So the only place I can read like comments is Instagram DMs, I guess. All right, someone said, hi, I think you should go home and stand up for Hyland. I see, the thing is, the issue now is me getting my butt beat by my dad. It's not even standing up for Hyland. I'm already standing up for Hyland. I'm really worried going home because my dad is gonna flip out. And when my dad, Baba Saleh, is flipped out, I promise you guys, he's a different person. He does not give two Fs. All right, someone else said, sorry, I couldn't say this on your video because the comments were disabled. But whatever you do, you absolutely cannot go home or you will literally die. To be honest, I 100% agree. The only reason why I haven't been home yet is because obviously my aunt is there. But at the same time, I'm really scared. I'm telling you guys, my dad, it, it, he's a savage. I'm telling you. All right, someone else said, Adam, I would like to ask if there is a problem on your Twitter account. Your tweets don't show me that and your account does not exist when I am on your page. Is there a problem? Please answer me. Uh, I deactivated my Twitter. I don't really want to talk about it right now, but I'll talk about it maybe sometime soon. All right, someone named Esma said, Hey, hey Adam, I just want to apologize for misjudging you. I used to think you were just a silly fool with your stupid videos. However, Allah is my witness. You have all my respect after watching your last YouTube videos. I am half Yemeni myself 
and I was disowned by my family for trying to be myself. I was caught a few times and threatened to be shipped to Yemen where no one could find me, especially after witnessing a killing one of my cousins in Yemen over an accusation. Luckily, me being British citizen, I feel blessed and protected in a way, but I feel so bad for those ones who have no much options. I salute you, Adam, and I salute Silly Slim for breaking the rule and fight for Sophia, which in Yemeni culture is such a big thing. You have all my love and respect. Please be strong and happy. And fight for Haile, Dina, and Rima. Wow, yo, that is just, I'm, I'm speechless. That, that's, I'm sorry to hear about what happened to your cousin. And I really hope right now you're happy and you're living in a safe place, doing what you love. And I hope you stay strong. You have my support. And it's all good about misjudging me. A lot of people, they always misjudge me. But it's always gonna be like that. People will always misjudge you, but you just gotta keep going, you know? All right, someone named Ranish said, got mine. Hey, she got her tickets for the charity tour with me and Amir Khan this Ramadan. I'm so, so excited. Yo, well, I appreciate everything you're doing, man. This is gonna be my bed. This shit is comfy as hell, trust me. I, I know, man. I've said that before. Yeah. I'm so, so tired. Fanny, what the? Fanny, get the hell out of here, bro. I'm the one for me. Bro, you have a crib. You can stay in your house. God, I'm homeless. I <laughs> Go home. Yo, Slim, it's cool if I crash it. Yeah, you can see the floor, though. <laughs> no, no, you, you know what? I have a good idea. You can sleep under the bed. That's a good idea. I'm <laughs> <laughs> a monster. I like the idea of that one. I like your idea. <laughs> nah, but seriously, he even gave me some more clothes. His merch, one of my favorite merch right here. It's a brand new day today. Say what? It's comfy. I'm asleep in it. Samola, thank you so much. I'm gonna end the vlog here, Fadi. You gotta get the hell out of here now because you yeah, can't. Unless you, know, you wanna sleep together, I don't mind. We wanna cuddle. I hope you guys enjoy this video until tomorrow. We do not know what the heck is gonna be up tomorrow, but we'll see what happens. My dad is most likely gonna call me. So we're gonna see what's gonna happen with my dad tomorrow. If you guys enjoy this video, make sure you guys give it a giant thumbs up and go turkey. Thank you guys so much for your love and support. Once again, I'm sorry. I feel bad, man. I'm sorry for like. For everything, well, I'm sorry, it's bro. It's all good, man. It's all good, G. It's all good. Just don't do that I'm shit tired. again. I'm not. <laughs> it's all good, don't I'm tired as hell. I'm about to go to sleep. Do not forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care. And peace. Later.